Hello everyone, welcome back to Dig or Die. Now in the last episode, you know, we kind of just got started out, you know, did our first two days, got a little acclimated to the planet and everything, right? So now today what I want to do is now that we've upgraded our uh, miniaturizer and everything, I really, really want to take a look at, um, I, I want to dig down a little bit and kind of see, you know, what it is that we really need to get into. Um, so looking at this, you know, we've got a couple of things that we're going to need. Um, we definitely need the dweller armor to help us out. And I really want to get, oh, I just remember what we needed. Okay. Um, so I want to get the dweller armor and the mini mapper is like the biggest thing that we need to get right now. Now to get that, um, I do need two bat sonars and I know exactly where to get those. And those are actually going to be where we need to get the red ferns because I know where the red fern grows. If, if you ever, if you remember anything from high school, middle school or anything like that, and if you were privy to reading that book, then you know what I'm talking about. Um, it's a very old book though, I think. Now, granted me, myself and, and I, I did not read that book. I just know the title. Go ahead and kill these guys off and go ahead and pick up a couple things that I'm gonna need there. Um, I do want to be very careful at, um, you know, kind of looking at getting rid of some of this stuff because there's, so there's a couple of things that I've learned throughout playing this game is that, um, water is actually very good. It, it can be a pain in the butt. Um, however, it can actually be a very, very good thing and it can be an asset for you later on down the road. And the reason for that is you can actually create um, a high. It's um, God. I'm gonna I'm gonna totally mess this up because you know my speech right now apparently is is escaping me. But you can um, have hydroelectric power. There you go. That that there's my speech for today. Hydroelectric power um, is something that we can actually really look into and and help build a base for that uh, to give us electricity. So that'll be really interesting. Now, I don't know if you guys just saw here just a second ago, but you can see this up here, right? In the upper right hand corner of the screen, there is an island up there. And that's something that we will be getting to, not right away, but we will get to it. Um, it's gonna take us a little bit to get to it because you know we still have to get a couple of other things and we need something a little bit stronger than what we have now building wise. Not to mention the fact that, you know, we need a ton of iron. And here's how we are going to get our bat sonars, because the bats. Definitely tell that we're getting closer to where I need to be at. Because of the bats and everything. And yeah, we are, we are at the chasm. <laughs> so, as you can see to the left of me, we, um, we are at the big chasm. I don't know if I necessarily, I, I don't want to jump down here yet because it's going to take forever to get back up here. <laughs> it really is. Um, so I just need to make sure that we're going about this in the correct way. Because we need to get over there. The red fern, the red fern grows over there. So in order for us to make it over there, we're going to have to build a bridge. Um, do I have the ability to do that? Actually, I do. I do. I have concrete walls and I have um, iron supports. So let me let me actually make some more iron here out of the scrap metal that uh, I've collected. And then let's go ahead and create some supports. And then we'll go ahead and create uh, some concrete walls. No, oh, can't create anymore because I don't have any more stone. So that's fine. All right, so we're just going to start by getting some of this built up in here. Now there are, there's, there's a couple things that you can do when it comes to this. So if you really wanted to, you can't, there is a recoil with your, with your gun. So I'm actually not step. I'm not, I'm not going back at all. This is, this is just the recoil. That's happening right now. So I can actually make it a pretty decent amount 
when I go backwards. So we'll just have to kind of play around with that. I don't know exactly how far I want to build this out, but you do have to be careful though, because it's just like everything else that you do when it comes to building something, the stress of the weight of what you are building has an effect on what you do. So you can see how I have this all the way out here and then that one has now cracked. So you can keep going, but the more stress you put out here, or the more stress you put back here, um, the worse it's going to be for this little area. So I think what I need to do, and sometimes it's not easy to uh, to build these up. It, it really, really isn't. So you see I gave it a little bit more support underneath, and now that is back to where it was. So that's good. That, unfortunately, is not good. And neither is this bat coming at me. <laughs> Did get a bat sonar off of that one, though, so that's, that's fine. All right, so disadvantage to this, too, though, is that I can only go out so far. Now, you can, once you get it, you can hook it up over to the ground that's over here, which does help bridge it a little bit better. Um, okay, so I have some structural weakness happening down here and over there now. And you can walk through this. You can walk through it. It is possible to walk through it. Um, I am out of structural supports, though. So let's... Can I build more? I can build more. I mean, I need one more bat sonar, please. There we go. Haha. -ha. Ooh, I actually already had the ones that I needed. Yeah. Okay. I want the mini mapper. <laughs> and here's the reason why. Here's the mini mapper up here. This is why I wanted this to give me a better view of what's going on. Go away. Bye-bye. Thanks. Um, okay, this is creating a lot of stress back here. What if I... What if I come back this way? Ooh. Well, that helped that out. What about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away from me. Okay. Okay, so I'm doing okay, but the, the stress of this is not doing too well here. Um. Ah, oh, crap. I just lost all of it, too. Dang it. Oh, no. Oh, this is going to take me a minute to rebuild, too. Crap. Uh, I really want to go down and get all that stuff. I hate that I just lost all of that stuff. Dang it. I didn't lose it, lose it. It just, it, it fell down the chasm. You know what? We're going to go down and get it. We're just, we're going to drop down the chasm. We're going to go get my stuff. Oh. Oh my god, I'm falling! No, it's really not that bad. <laughs> Really not that bad. All right. See, all of my stuff ended up down here on the ground floor. Um, I don't want to swim too far deep because I don't want to kill myself. Running out of air. Running out of air. No. Okay. That's fine. See, even if you run out of air, you only lose, you know, just a little bit. Um, <laughs> I don't want to go over here. I don't. I don't want you. I don't want to kill you. I'm going to have to anyway. I don't... It's two different bats. There there are two different bats in here. There's there's an okay bat and then there's a, another bat. And <laughs> that is not the okay bat. That was a bad bat. And it's almost nighttime. Go figure. I'm going to spend this entire episode just looking for the red fern. Dang it. Where do you? Okay. Um, And I'm also going to spend time... <sighs> building something to go back up but that's okay that's okay and the reason why i say it's okay is because um i am actually going to have a bunch of stuff to build stuff when i get back up there anyway because trying to get back up top i i literally am going to have to um 
when I have to dig my way up. And it's the reason, part of the reason why this is called dig or die. We're gonna have to make our way back up to the surface. And then it's almost nighttime, so we're also gonna have to uh, fend off these enemies as well. This is where this is where it gets a little bit stressful. And also the simple fact that um, this thing is not very fast when it comes to mining, so. Sorry, dog woke up from a nap and I had to get him, I had to let him out. Yeah, the advantage of, of where I'm at right now though, ooh, copper, need that. So the advantage of where I'm at right now is it's actually kind of difficult for some of these creatures to get to where I am. Um, as you can see, it took the bats a little bit longer to get up here. And it actually kind of helps if you are in a little bit of a secluded area when um, when nighttime hits. And see, right now, the only thing that's attacking me are these freaking bats. Oh, 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 the other thing I wanted to point out, too, is that um, down over here in the lower right hand corner, you can see there's little numbers down there. I don't know if you can see it or not, but the number. Ah, dang it. So the number on the right is how far down we are in depth. And then the number on the left is how far we are from the le most left hand point of the screen. This is not good. It's the first time I've ever seen this happen. Never seen bats actually like make their way through like that. <laughs> no. This is not good. I've definitely seen those guys do that before. What concerns me about being here is me being trapped. And I'm running out of health. Crap, 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 crap. Not good, not good, not good, not good. No. Okay, that's a little bit better. Woo. And I think we have survived the night, so that's, that's good. Now we just need to get rid of the rest of the guys that are following us. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's going to take me like, it's going to take me a whole day to get out of here. Holy crap. Okay. Yes. All right. Making a little bit of headway here. Now we don't, we aren't going to go up to, so I'm at 461. So I'm not actually going up to zero. I'm going up to, I'm going to say like 700. I would kind of, I would go in and mine this stuff, but I want to get, I want to get our ultimate goal done for today. And that's getting um, the red fern so we can get our auto builder. Okay. So if we go this way. Granted, grabbing some of this stuff is nice, but we don't need all of it. Actually, I wonder if can I come out here to the um, to the edge? I wonder if this is going to be a little bit easier. Actually, I think this is going to be easier coming up the side of the chasm rather than um, the center of it. Ooh, I don't think I can mine that yet. Nope, not yet. It's aluminum. I no, can't have aluminum yet. Eventually, maybe one day. I want to get to like a cave, but it doesn't look like I'm there's actual there's any actual caves that I can get to right now. There are any even on the side. Uh, let me do. Let's do this. Let's put you there. Uh, builder, give me some more of those. It's probably what I should have been doing anyway. It's just going straight up instead of trying to make my way up that way. Let's go this way. You can see how much water actually comes down here with the amount of rain that's coming down. This is insane. Okay. Hindsight probably shouldn't have, uh, drop down this way. I don't know how much longer it's going to, you know what? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get to the top and then I will be right back. 
Okay, so what I didn't know was that you can actually build these um, along the edge, which I I'm really, really happy about right now because it's actually saving me a lot of time. Um, I've been able to make my way up here a little bit faster than um, what I originally thought I was going to take. And I have apparently hit a cavern. So this is going to make it even easier now to get back up to the top. Um... Well, okay, so I thought it was going to make it easier, but apparently I'm wrong. So let's just uh, let's just continue ascending up this way. Let's get rid of that bat. Get rid of him. Bye-bye. And should be able to... Got the kickback on these weapons sometimes, I swear. All right. You know, sometimes it feels like the... Uh, the, the keys on here are just very, very sensitive. That way, when I hit dirt, dirt is completely fine when it comes to, you know, trying to um, to mine it because it's not it's not that hard. It actually goes really, really fast to do that. Uh, apparently, I'm out. Need more. Of course, I've got, you know, I've got plenty of wood to get up here. Um, I'm actually, I think I'm almost there. That's not what I wanted to do. Let's go there, there. Not going to risk that. <laughs> Definitely not going to risk that. Um, ah, no, no. If I can find areas that have a lot of dirt, then I'm just going to go straight up that way. Because it is a lot easier. So let's go this way. Really wishing I wouldn't have gone down there yet. But well. I can do about it now. Just have to deal with it. There go. See now this is going much much faster now. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, um, let's see, let's go, let's go up this way. That, okay, this bat really needs to go away. I don't like him. Understand why I'm getting hit with bats so much right now. Out this way. Now, eventually... Eventually, you will have access to a jetpack, and jetpacks are very, very nice because they, then you can just go straight up the chasm. Well, okay, so not completely straight up the chasm. You have to, uh, you know, you, you still have um, a limited ability when you use the jetpack. That's what I was trying to say. Yes, we are at red dirt. Okay, good. I have, let's go there. Let's go. Let's grab you. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, this is taking way too long. Seriously? Go away. Don't need you anymore. Aha! And we are to the surface. Nice. Okay, that didn't take nearly as long as what I thought it was going to. I lie. It took longer than what I thought it was going to. And here are the red ferns, finally. Yes. Okay. All right. So I now have, that's five red ferns. That's exactly what I needed. Uh, let's go ahead and place this down. Okay. I need a eh, gun. Thank you. And we can now do, finally, auto builder three. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Um, <laughs> it is now nighttime. Great. Perfect. Um, so I guess the only other things that I'm going to need now are... So I need coral. I need five coral and I need three red energy gems um, to get my miniaturizer three taken care of. Um, which will be fine. Th that, that'll be okay. Um, I think we need to... So what we need to do, we need to get through this night... As I'm going to try and get through this night, um, or as I, as we are getting through the night, I should say, um, I'm going to try and build a bridge back over to the other side. 
I don't know how well this is going to work out, um, but we're going to try. I think what I want to do is we'll get rid of this. Um, no. It is officially nighttime. Night four. We just need to survive the night. Um, let's see. Where's my starting point at? Let's go down here. Do I have stuff to build? I do. Oh, see, that's that's going to that's going to cause some hurt right there. These guys are. I don't like them. I hate them. You do have to be careful, though, when you're when you're using your machine gun, because it will overheat and slow down. Ah. To get out of there. There we go. There we go. There we go. Come on, get him. Get him. Clearly, me building was was not going to happen. Did not happen at all. Sorry about you. Not gonna work. Ooh, 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 ooh. Get him, get him, get him. Come on, come on. Yeah, the other advantage that we did have with unlocking that um the auto builder three is we now have options for better weapons. I don't know that we have access to any hydropower yet but I really really want to make sure that we get a good established base before we do anything else let me see let's go in here so yeah I do actually have um, the options to do hydropower which I'm gonna have to do a little research on that and see how that works out because I'm not entirely sure I am not entirely sure how that works, but we will figure it out. Um, let's get rid of the last of these guys, and then we are good. Can't believe it's been two days already, and holy crap. <laughs> that went really, really fast. Um, I'm trying not to do too much at one point. Um, so we did get our red ferns. We did get... Um, let's go ahead and pause the game so it doesn't go any further. We got the red ferns. We got uh, our auto builder 2 taken care of. Um, so now we need to go back. We need to get, uh, we need to get some coral. We need to get a few things that we're going to need to get a couple better weapons and also a better miniaturizer too. So we can have some aluminum. That aluminum is definitely going to help us out, uh, when it comes to, um, building this stuff down here. So we need ore, we need gold. So we've got some stuff that we're going to need, um, to find. Definitely going to need to find gold for sure. So anyway... That is all I have for you guys. If you liked the video, go ahead and give it a like. Questions, comments, concerns that you have, put it down in the comment section below. At the end of the video, you guys will see... Sorry, my mouth is a little dry. Um, there is a um, website you can go to for Patreon to go ahead and donate there if you'd like. Or you can check out everything else you want to know about me in the description down below when it comes to donations, either via Patreon, PayPal, anything like that. Anything you can give would be greatly appreciated. All of that helps make more videos and better videos with maintaining the equipment that I have. So anyway, that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.